small crowd, but loud and proud, I'm digging it. We're going to start off tonight's show the way we start every show, Micro Championship Wrestling. It doesn't matter what city we're in, it doesn't matter what state we're in, and it definitely doesn't matter what country we're in. We always start our show the same way. And that's by thanking the U.S. military troops due to the great job taking care of business overseas. And if it wasn't for the U.S. military, we would have a freedom to do this show tonight. So the U.S. military guys, come on. Woo! Oh, I'm it that loud right there. All right. And for my veterans out in the crowd, God bless you out there. Thank you. We are you all my personal heroes, man. Let's give up our veterans out there tonight. Now tonight, we got a car that's a little bit mixed up. We're going to throw some things around and play tag war games tonight. So to first start this evening off, we are going to have your one and only Border Patrol MCW superstar known as Lieutenant Dan. Come on out here right now. We're going to bring Lieutenant Dan. Superstars is from south of the border, and from what I hear, his papers may not be in inter incorrect, you know, whatever you want to call it. Tell me, Lieutenant Dan, what do you want to do about that situation? You know what, Johnny? Since his paperwork's here at Ryan and everything, I say I have a match with him, kick his ass, take him back to the border. Show him what USA is all about. Build the wall. That's right. <laughs> well, Lieutenant Dan, there's quite a bit of size difference between you and Loco. I will let you know this. I don't know much about this MCW superstar. As I said, he's only been here for a couple of weeks on this side of the border, and he does not speak any English. But here's what I know about him. He comes in from Tijuana, Mexico. He's known as being crazy. Here in MCW, we just simply call him Loco. All the homies, they know what I mean. Baby, let me show you. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
All right, Jimmy, first thing I do is check out the MCW belt. MCW is the number one major wrestling company in the world today. So the major now wears that belt is the number one major wrestler in the world. All right, it's a match on what it's all about. I just slide away from him. All right, Jimmy Max, gonna pat him down. Make sure they got no weapons. <laughs> hey, you're not getting arrested, Loco. Yeah, man, put it in position. 
could decide a champion is going to get it. But that game last week and that crowd had me. Two count, and again, 
uh, champion, King Samoa coming out, saving our champion, Lieutenant Dan, and all you guys are trying to walk his right job, he keeps walking away from me. Hey, hey, what's with Johnny? You know what, Johnny? You let this paper champion have a match and not the real guys? So you know what? How about this? We have a six-man tag right now. A six-man tag? Well, you know what? I only see five people out here, but I'll tell you what. If you want a six-man tag, I might have a partner for you, Lieutenant Dan. He ain't in, but he's close. I'm gonna bring out somebody who hasn't really been here in the arena too much opportunity, but we're gonna make the evenings, we're gonna make the TV. Let's bring out Fantasia! Come on out here, Fantasia! She's been training, and Fantasia's been training. I'm gonna have to step in the ring for an opportunity here at the MCW Championship. So it looks like Honey Cup. Where are you now? Let me find you, Honey Cup. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, hey, you got a girl for your team? <laughs> this ain't WNBA. Who is this? You got a female on their team? Oh, girl power state. Y'all oh, shut up. Girl power state. That's why Hillary lost. <laughs> but you know what, Johnny? We accept that challenge. All right, you accept the challenge? I'll tell you what, I like it. You guys, what do you think about it? We want to let Fantasia step in the row for a six-man tag? Yeah. I said we're making one step better. Let's make a six-man tag. And let's start it off with Fantasia and Honey Club starting it off. I'm gonna start with Nicki Minaj. <laughs> hey, hey. Are you serious, Johnny? Hey, calm down. Calm down, because you know what? After this match, I'm gonna have you iron my clothes, cooking my food, and walking my dog. Seriously. I'm JT. You got Beyonce, my slave. Let's get it on, Charlie. I'm gonna make you a sandwich. Stop that. You're talking to me? You're on her talking team. Talking to me? You're rooting for her. No, you're about to get your butt kicked. Flat out. What? Baby. No, she didn't. Yes, she did. No, she didn't. Yes, she did. No, she didn't. <laughs> Who gave you her this heart? Look at your Oma. Okay, Johnny. <laughs> After the night, you'll be down one diva. Call me Iker tonight. Holly Cup talks to the game about, hey, what? Kasia has been in training camp with MCW. And it should be interesting. All right, you guys know we gotta go get this match started. When I say half the size, you say twice the fun, I ring the bell, and then uh, we see what Fantasia can do in the ring here with Hulika. The midget can beat each other up. All right, guys, loud and proud. When I say half the size, you say twice the fun, and the midgets will beat each other up for your pleasure. And she doesn't have the size. Twice the fun! Let's get her! Let's get it back. No, I don't know. Take 
vacation with those after a quarter to just get rid of mice. The veterans, it's the mama, smart move. Hey, hey. Super to check it out. It's getting absolutely over. And there's no reason why. How do you come? Play it. Ow! Form across the forehead. How do you come? That's right on top of Lieutenant Dan. Kicks him up between and now he points to her Mickey Nosh. Wrestling world, 
and Jake Samoa, the reverend generation professional wrestler, his father and his grandfather. Hey, Roddy, Jake, you want to back out? I got back with another shot. I can't kick Samoa around. Pitch up. Hey, Otto. Those were his thoughts. Raising him across his back. And Jake Samoa grabbing his head. He's got him on his neck. A splash on the ribs! <laughs> Roddy Savage can't get it! A 315 pound logo! Oh my god! Double two count! How did Shinsha Maul get it? Ooh! And the 315 pounds of blood are coming down! I don't know, I'll be in check! With ease, look at the power of this Mexican. Oh. And tries to get him up. Takes him up at 245 pounds of muscle. One, two, kill him. Yeah. Yeah. And Holly Cut wants to attack me. He wants to fight me. Let's go, let's go. Watch around. Holly Cut goes into the second row. Turn a little bit. Go. And how you roll him up, positioning each one where he wants him, hits the rope. Oh no! The hockey shot! The legs are weak! The hips are moving! He's in his right body! Oh my god! Again! Oh, he was coming out! Oh, he's coming out! Oh, he's coming out! And how he comes! A two count! He threw something like the 50s, 60s, and the 70s! Oh, he's coming out! Oh, he's got more ideas. He's recording. He's going to hit the rope again. Look at this. The window. In fast motion. Oh, he misses it this time. Oh, he got this in. Jake Samoa is slowly trying to get to his feet. He gets up. How do you Doesn't know what happened. And... Oh, my God. Yeah. 
Shove your shoes off and hit the ring. If I get your attention with this alone, please, I want to say thank you all for your great audience, as you all know. This is professional Woo! wrestling, which is also known as sports entertainment, everybody. What that means is this. We're one big family here in MCW. So whether they play the good guy or a bad guy, or a good guy or a girl, I'm good, good girl. So all great guys and girls that play a character so they can entertain you, and we hope we get a good job entertaining you tonight. Let's go, let's give it back, I'm a green. Rocky Savage. No boom. The beautiful Bobos. Yeah. Chips are appreciated. 